The Nokia XL runs on the Nokia X software platform version 1.0 based on Android 4.1 Jelly Bean, but has been extensively modified. Long story short, it's Android with a custom launcher where Google services have been replaced by Microsoft ones. Nokia has done some great work optimizing its proprietary launcher to ensure the performance is good enough to run on the relatively modest dual-core configuration. The final result is decently smooth with a minimal amount of visible lag. Let's take a look at Nokia's custom launcher. It's a mix between the latest Asha software platform and Windows Phone with some entirely new twists here and there. The app drawer on the Nokia XL looks a lot like a Windows Phone home screen, with all app shortcuts taking on the form of Windows Phone live tiles. They are resizable too, and you can change the color. You can and you can even change the base color of each tile. What's different is actually none of these tiles are live due to the hardware limitations of the device. This home screen will list all of your installed apps, so it might re get really long if you don't organize your shortcuts into folders. Standard Android widgets are also supported. You get the familiar analog clock, calendar, email, Facebook, power control deck, and more. Apps that come with a dedicated widget, such as BBM, will also appear in the widget menu. Swiping left or right of the app drawer will take you to the other home screen called Fastlane. Those of you familiar with the Asha user interface will recognize it immediately. It keeps track of all your current activity, including opened apps, visited web pages, along with contacts you've called, messages, emails, calendar events like birthdays and to dos, radio stations, and even social network posts, replies, likes, and goings on. The music player, if active, will also appear here. You can also pull down the status bar to show notifications for missed events and quick toggles for sound profiles, Wi Fi, Bluetooth, and mobile data. The Here Maps app is, ob is on board, combining both the Maps Explorer and turn by turn voice navigation functionalities previously available on Windows Phone as separate applications. There are lots of games pre installed on the XL, as well as BBM Messenger, Facebook, Twitter, Nokia Mixed Radio upper web browsers, and even two file managers from which you can sideload Android APKs. Nokia's dedicated store is quite rich, with even more apps joining it by the minute, so hopefully you won't need to do much sideloading.